<laughs> it came from above. What is that? There's a strange, unidentified flying object above us. <coughs> ah, it crashed. What could it be? Calm down, Sheriff. Maybe it's just a helicopter or something. Hello? Why are you so scared of this movie, dude? Yeah, like we just got to the part where the alien showed up. <laughs> the aliens are scary! <laughs> oh, come on, Withered Freddy, it's not that bad. Yeah, this movie's fine. It's just a, just, just a little silly alien movie. I'm sure nothing bad's gonna happen at all. <laughs> Maybe you guys are right. <laughs> <gasps> Oh, God, it's, it's a real genuine alien! Stop! Everyone, this moment is pivotal. If we don't create peace with this alien, we can start a thousand-year war that only ends in chaos and destruction. Mr. Alien, sir, we, the human race, come in peace. Delicious, Neem Nord, I'm an alien, Neem Nord. Now time to go eat everybody, Neem Nord. <laughs> so scary. <laughs> Ugh, that movie sucked. Kind of worried about Withered Freddy. Think someone should go try and talk to him? This feels more deep rooted than just a simple fear of aliens. I'll get over it. I'm afraid of spiders. You don't see me crying about it. I mean, there was like kind of a whole episode where you cried about it, and I was like, that one did really well, actually. Shut up! I'll go talk to him. <laughs> hey, Withered Freddy, what's wrong? Aliens are just so scary. They make my heart do that shaky thing, and then I shake, and then everything shakes, and then I'm, I get dizzy, and I need to lay down. What's so scary about aliens anyway? Well, cuz, Golden Freddy, I mean, they could be anywhere. They could be anyone, and they could show up at any time and completely destroy the entire planet. Anyone could be an alien. I could be an alien. Bonnie could be an alien. You could be an alien. Yeah, that's crazy. Don't look at my citizenship's records. <laughs> what? Nothing. I don't know. I think the only thing that would ever bring me comfort about this whole alien shtick is if somebody told me they weren't ever real. I mean, it's kind of scientifically impossible for aliens not to be real. The idea that we're the only planet in the entire infinite universe that has life on it is, like, second to none. I don't know if they're ever going to show up here, but, like... Aliens definitely exist. Ow! I deserve that. <laughs> Withered Freddy, would you just calm down already? Look, the odds that any alien would even get close to having the technology to be able to actually encounter us and say hi, you know, or destroy the planet, is like second to none. There's no way we're ever going to see aliens and you're never going to have to worry about it. But what about that one time in season four? They were from the moon. That's different. How is that different? Well, they're technically Lunarians, not aliens. Oh, okay. So just stop worrying about it. It's not a big deal. <sighs> okay, Weather Golden Freddy. Yeah, now how about we go watch those silly, fictional, stupid, dumb, dumb, dummy, dumb, dumb alien movies, and you can stop being so scared of them. Okay. Oh, we're waiting for it. Let's go. No! What was that? Did somebody get into a car crash or something? Let's go check it out. Ooh! Uh, ooh. <coughs> oh, it's so smoky out here. What the heck happened? I don't know. We just heard a weird explosion outside and there was just a bunch of smoke everywhere. Do you think someone's hurt? Maybe someone threw a smoke bomb on the ground. You know, he's got a point. Uh, guys, you might want to take a look at this. Oh. Oh, it's a genuine spaceship! What? No, it's not. It's just a giant backpack. No, it says spaceship right on it. No, it doesn't. Oh, yeah, I guess it does. We have to have them! Maybe there's some people on it they crashed in our yard! Get the shit out of the way! Yes! What if there's aliens on this spaceship? Freddy, like I said, there's no way it's aliens. Maybe someone tried launching a rocket into space today, and I don't know, maybe it just crashed in our yard. There could have been an accident. Oh, 
I guess you're right. Hang on, Foxy. Let me help. Uh, uh, what the hell are these things? What? X smart. Move out of the way, Bozo. I'm the best reader out of all of us. X smart global. What the hell's an X smart global? Why do they look like weird sack things? They feel like skin. Uh. Um. What was that? That was just a gulp. Oh. Ugh. Wait. Do you guys think these are like eggs? Maybe. Maybe the ship is a mother. Oh god. Did we just perform a C-section? Nah. I don't think that's it. I think whoever was storing these weird egg things must have crash landed on our planet. Guys, I don't know about you, but I think that we need to take care of these things. Because, I mean, whatever birds them must be kind of sad that their babies aren't here. Oh, Foxy, you're actually pretty level-headed right now. You're right. I need more alcohol. <sighs> Guys, are we sure these aren't alien eggs? Even if they are Freddy, then, you know, they might not be hostile. Maybe they're friendly aliens. You ever seen Coneheads? Like that movie. Like with Dan Aykroyd? Yeah. I, I mean, I, I suppose. Come on, guys, let's go make a little bed for these guys. I don't like this one bit. Oh, Wither Freddy, calm down. I'm sure it's nothing. <laughs> Maybe this will be a good experience for you. Maybe you can get over your fear of aliens this way. I hope so. There you go, little eggies. A little Betty for you guys. Well, now what? Well, I suppose we just have to take care of them until they hatch. Ugh, it's getting kind of late. Oh, I have an idea! How about each one of us uh, is assigned to an egg and we have to take care of it? That doesn't sound like a terrible idea. Yeah, maybe we'll get to foster it like, you know, a mother sits on her eggs. Let's do it! Ooh, this one's mine! I'll take this one. I gotta take this one. Uh, you have fun with that, Golden Freddy. Uh, you know, there's only four eggs and five of us, so I shouldn't need to do this. Mm -hmm. Eh, Wither Freddy, why don't you do it? <laughs> Why? Like I said, this is a good experience to get over your fear of aliens. Maybe raising one like your own will, you know, help you get over your trauma. <laughs> but I don't want to get over my fear of aliens. Well, that's very close-minded of you, Freddy. Oh, you know what I meant. Come on, Freddy. What are you, chicken? I am not a chicken. I am a bear. That is a scientific fact. I'm gonna man. You do figure this out in the morning. Come on, Freddy, just do it. Just for one night at least. For me. Please. Stop giving me the big cutie eyes. They're not going to work on me. Please. Mm -mm. Not giving in. Nope. Please. Jesus Christ, Wither Golden Freddy's going to get a hernia. Please just do it, Freddy. Okay, fine. God. <laughs> I'm okay, I'm okay. Oh, you did it. Nice. Alright, well, I'm gonna go sleep in my normal bed. Uh, good night, guys. Night with her, Golden Freddy. <sighs> uh, Alright, night, guys. Night. Night. <sighs> I'm not gonna be able to sleep like this. <sighs> No, Withered Freddy, you need to get over your fears. I'm never gonna stop being afraid of aliens if I don't face my fears. <sighs> yeah, you, Mr. Smart Global. I don't even know how you speak English. Maybe that lowers the chances that they're aliens since they speak English. I'm gonna face my fears. I'm gonna be strong. All right, now it's just time to try and get some shut-eye. <sighs> All right, it's been two hours. I give up. I just can't get my anxiety to go away. Oh, whatever. I've been here for like half the night. I'm sure the egg's gonna be fine. <sighs> Sorry, guys. I couldn't get over my fear. I'm gonna go sleep in a nice comfy bed now. <sighs> Good morning, world. Uh, well, time to start my day. Ah! Uh, Wither Freddy, what are you doing in my bed? Oh, hi, Wither Golden Freddy. What are you doing in my bed? 
Sorry, Wiggle Gold Freddy. I couldn't sleep last night. I sat with the egg for like two straight hours, and I just couldn't strike the stick to feeling that something bad was going to happen. Well, I appreciate you for trying, at least. Not everyone's going to get over their fears. Sometimes the stuff just takes time. Mm, I appreciate you understanding. Yeah, well, I appreciate you for trying. All right, let's go see our wonderful three other friends that are taking care of those eggs. Okay. La 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 Ugh, morning guys, how'd it go that what the? Uh, did you guys get a haircut? Huh? What are you talking about? Good morning, Withered Freddy and Withered Golden Freddy. How are you two doing on these fine days? Yo, what's up, dudes? Uh, are you guys feeling okay? You're looking a little blue, Withered Bonnie. Ooh, what are you talking about? I have always been blue, Gleeb Glorp. I have always been blue. I am actually not a purple. Only FNAF 1 Bunny was purple. I am a blue revisionist. <laughs> Y'all, you guys are acting like crazy and stuff, man. Uh, we're like normal, like we've always been, dude. Uh-huh. What happened to the alien eggs? Oh, well, you see, they hatched overnight when you guys were asleep. It seems Withered Freddy didn't want to sit next to his very nice, calm, and very cute little ex-smart global branded Withered Egg. And, you know, I just didn't hatch. We released them all to their mother that came to collecting this morning. Trust me, Withered Freddy, she was very unhappy with you that you did not hatch her baby. Um, what happens when she's mad? She said she's gonna pick a random point in her life to kill you. Okay, sure, we're not gonna let that happen either way. So the mother really just came to collect her babies? Is she gonna want that one? I'm not over the fact she said she was gonna kill me! Hmm, perhaps maybe she won't if you hatch her baby for her tonight. Then maybe she will actually, you know, um, <laughs> not kill you and stuff. <laughs> yes, that is correct! If you hatch our baby for her, then she will not kill you! I know this because she said this to me and to my face! You guys are acting a little funny. You sure you're okay? Y'all, yeah, dude, like, we channeled our, like, really harmonious, um, harmonious energy when we slept with those eggs. We're actually so much better than before. We're, like, better, better. Like, if you're putting us on a scale of 1 to 10, before we were at, like, maybe a 2, now we're at, like, a 14. That's how good we are now. We are actually so much better than before. Like, good. Okay, if you guys say so. Anyways, Wither Freddy, you should take the egg and uh, raise it as your own and give it much very good kisses so that tomorrow when it touches, uh, you will not be fed to the mother's new babies that she has because she's going to kill you. Yeah, I guess. I really don't want to be eaten by babies. Hey, uh, Wither Freddy, can we, uh, can we have a pep talk for a second just real quick over here? What the fuck is going on? I don't know! Why are our friends acting so weird? They're just so off. Like, almost like they're trying to, like, impersonate our friends, but they couldn't do that because the alien eggs are gone and they're still here. I know. It's weird. But if they're really telling the truth about that mother egg stuff, maybe we should take care of it. And we can do it together. Really? you do that for me? Yeah. Partially because I want you to be able to do it, and also partially because I'm worried the mother might eat me too. Oh, fair. I guess we should try hanging out with him for the day, see what happens. Yeah, maybe it's just some weird morning edge. You know that thing where people wake up and their voice is a couple octaves deeper? Does that happen to you? Sometimes. Is that why we thought you were a dude for like three years? Uh, maybe. Alright guys, well I guess we can go hang out for a bit. Yes, but please do remember to take your delicious egg so the mother does not eat you and kill you and put with the fire. Oh, uh, okay. Sure, I'll... I'll, I'll take it mm, okay all right let's go hang out guys yeah let's let's go <clears throat> so uh what y'all want to do oh, do you guys want to see the funniest thing ever yeah bro i'd love to see the funniest thing ever uh all right go ahead with it chica <laughs> you guys are gonna love this look at this look at this isn't this final? Isn't this so final? Uh. No, no. What? That's the finalest thing I know! Uh, yeah, I just, uh, that wasn't really tickling my funny bone. Okay, you know that I found that final, but you gotta see the second finalest thing I know. 
Yes, I remember telling me about this. I like it. It's a very good, funny thing. Then she knows. This is feeling weird. Let's just have to see. Alright, let's do a second part of this together. Are you just twerking? It's a native dance! A native dance from what? What are you talking about? Nah, nah, nah! A, a dance I learned online! Okay. Yeah. Not very, not very funny, though. Okay, but what if I put them together? Is that funny? Is that funny at all? Is that funny? No! Ugh, okay, you know what, guys? This is stressing me out. I think I'm just gonna go tend to my egg. Um, you guys can just keep chilling. Are you gonna be good, Golden Freddy? Uh, yeah, I'll be alright. Okay. Oh, go, go, go relax, y'all. I don't know why this is, since I was Friday. I thought that was pretty Friday. Yes, we should all do it, actually, just because it's just because it's so funny. Uh, yeah, yeah, bro, let's do it. This might have been a mistake. Can you guys please stop? Fax it now! Huh? What? <gasps> oh. Oh, I don't get it. I don't understand why everyone's acting so weird. I swear, ever since we found these stupid alien eggs, they just haven't been themselves. Pale imitations, bashful bootlegs, cataclysmic copies. Oh, I just don't get it. It's like something happened overnight. Something terrible. Something I'm never gonna... Yes? Hello there, friend. No, folks, this is the scariest part of the video. No, 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 we can't end it like that. Oh, God, all my friends were replaced by alien monsters. I gotta save them somehow. I gotta, I gotta face my fears. You could do this, William Freddy. You could be the strongest Five Nights at Freddy's character. You could beat a billion lions if you put your mind to it. Maybe, I'd probably not, actually. Sir, the pills of Verizon Zeppelin's figure this out. I mean, a little. We are the secretly uh, alien spawn that have formed from your puny Earth bodies in order to sustain life from this planet's unique atmosphere. Oh, God. And we're here to replace you. We're here to replace all of you. Oh, your little friends. We're gonna start giving birth to more eggs, and we're gonna give those eggs to those people, and then they're all gonna become just like us. Oh, my horns! Are even worse than I imagined! Y'all, oh, there's nothing you can do about it. Ah! Wait, where's Golden Freddy? He has been taken to a secret location where you will never find them, and along with your other friends like before. I see. <sighs> Oh, with it, Freddy, it's just a couple of fakies, fake phony phonies. They can't be that strong. Uh, Succumb to our might. Oh, yes, oh God, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Huh? Is this a phone? Why not? Because if you touch that, it's not going to be very good for us. Well, your first mistake was telling me that. Maybe there's a self-destruct button or something and they all die. Self-destruct button? I would be stupid enough to put something like that on the ship. No, that calls our leader. Eh, eh, skibbity toilet. Wait, what? I am the alien leader! Oh, great powerful alien leader! What do you want? Why have you forsaken our planet? Uh, cause our socks, so we want yours. Y you want our planet? You know we, like, regularly have gods that, like, try and kill everybody, right? Like, I don't think you want this planet. Alright, old mother! I wanted to use your planet as a place to pr mass produce marketable pleasure so that they can all go out to feed the masses. I need to feed my intimate capitalist desires, man. But don't you see? Isn't things created by the hearts of our, of the artist way more visually effective and emotionally attached to human? People get attached to these things because they're made by people, not because they're made by soulless corporations and machines. No. Mm. I have an idea. Well, 
Yeah, you guys see that? You see the skibbity toilet? Oh my god, skibbity toilet! Whoa, swim in the toilet! Go, go get the skibbity toilet! Go get it! It's in here! It's in your it's in your spaceship! Get this get to get the skibbity toilet! What? No! Don't fall for it in the trap! Oh, I love skibbity toilet! Oh, we gotta go get the skibbity toilet, bro! Let's get the skibbity toilet! No! No, you moron! Stop that! Don't go in there! You don't need the skibbity toilet! Yeah. Go to space! Go away! Go home! Go away! Oh, blast for the ground! I did it! I won! Yay! I defeated the aliens! Thanks, Skibbity Toilet. First time and last time I think I'm ever gonna say that in my life. Oh, but where are all my friends? They said they took them to a secret location! Freddy. Huh? They're right here. What is that around you? They put their weird alien plants around us. I tried eating it. It's not very good. Huh. I'll tell you guys. Ooh. Ooh. That was uh, weird. Yeah, I woke up in the middle of the night and I was tied up and then they added Golden Freddy to the pile and we were like, why are there two versions of us? And, and then they kind of explained the whole thing. I'm so happy you guys are okay. I had to use the power of the integrity of the artist to stop them in their feeble little brains. Because you know what you can't spell heart without? Ear? Uh, I mean... You're technically right, but I was, I was thinking art less than ear. <laughs> art. I put an F at the start of that, it makes fart. Tell me that artist integrity bull crap really worked on them. No, I had to use skibbity toilet to activate their dopamine receptors. That makes a lot more sense. Sorry for making fun of you before, Freddy. Yeah, I guess you were right about aliens all along. I appreciate you guys trying to, you know, soothe you guys making fun of me for being afraid of aliens, but like... I don't know if I'm very comforted knowing that they're real and very much after our planet. Well, hopefully we never have to deal with the weird X-Smart global place again. Ha 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 ha. Wait, was this like a like an anti-X-Smart video? Like, like, what was that? No, 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 it wasn't that. It, it was to justify to keep using the customs instead of switching to the plushies because people just like them a lot. Oh. Huh. I was wondering what that message was about, because, like, X-Mart's not, like, a corporation. They're, like, just, like, bootleggers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Just making sure.